Ember, this is uh, what we're talking about today. So um, I've had the pleasure of working for this company for um, just about five years now. Um, been in a number of different roles um, with the brand as we've been emerging. My initial role actually was on our, our Starbucks new product integration launch team. So our first uh, official retail partner back in 2000. 18 actually was Starbucks, which is really fun for us. Um, we were able to learn a lot about um, getting into retail markets and uh, and also as a really unique opportunity because it was very coffee centric. Um, so a lot of our initial products that we were launching were, you know, very focused around coffee um, and really having that ease of access to and uh, and kind of, again, just being able to see the product in person, I think was huge for us as an early brand. So um, a bit of background here on, on Ember specifically. Um, so Ember really, it was created to, to solve a, a relatively simple problem. Um, and, that, and that's really all about temperature control, right? So, you know, when you would, when you set your air conditioning or even your heat inside your house, you don't just set it to kind of cool or kind of hot or, you know, whatever. You set it to an exact degree, same with cooking, you know, you're going to set, you know, um, an oven to exactly 350 degrees. So the idea behind Ember was why can't, that, why can't we take the, the concept of temperature control and implement that more into our daily lives outside of necessarily, you know, a few things that we're doing for today, uh, during the day. Why couldn't we take that and, and implement it into everything we do? So Clay really came up with the idea. Um, actually, the first product that he had in terms of the prototype was actually a, a plate. And we're still working on some more dishware and our, our dishware lines will be launching uh, on the roadmap within the next couple of years now. Um, but he, uh, he made some eggs in the morning and tossed the eggs on the plate um, and then had to go, he was, uh, had a newborn, so he had to go take care of um, his daughter and then came back to the plate and his eggs were cold. And he said, you know, this is, this is ridiculous. Why can't I come up with an idea or, or, or an invention rather to keep things hot and maintain the exact temperature that I want to enjoy that at? So that's a little bit of a background about um, the product and the idea behind Ember. But the first product we really brought to market and, um, and we, we actually just brought our baby bottle to market last week, which is really exciting too, were our temperature controlled drinkware items. Um, so you'll see here, this is our 14 ounce mug, which you guys will have complete access to. Um, this is our travel mug. And then this is one of our newer products in the line, which is a six ounce mug, a little bit of a lower price point, more entry. I would say this is really aimed at someone who already may have an Ember mug and they're, you know, really into coffee and they're utilizing it for um, more espresso and, and kind of like latte art and, and whatnot. But, um, but you can see here again, it works great on a desk kitchen environments, um, and they just look really good standing alone too. Uh, and I'll get in a little bit more into how the product works here, and you guys will have access to these brand assets as well too. Um, so currently we have a number of high quality retail partners. Um, we're in Apple stores globally uh, in 134 countries. We're in Best Buy um, nationally in the United States, as well as in Best Buy Canada uh, in, in brick and mortar as well as online. We're in Bloomingdale's. We have uh, presence at Costco. Um, we've been Kohl's for a while. Uh, this is like a smaller piece that we've been working on. Obviously, we're in Target. It's one of our major retailers. We do really well with them, specifically during holiday season. Uh, Williams Sonoma is a, a good outlet for us as well. But a number of you know fine retailers that we have presence in currently. Um, it's just really been growing the brand and the awareness over the last number of years as well, too. So in part, you know, now our, our idea is how do we generate the widest amount of exposure to, um, to really introduce this product and what these products do to, to the audience. So again, here's the, the main three products that you guys will have access to. And, and they're really our best sellers too. So I'm, I'm not sure um, that may have been a coincidence that we planned that. But so we have 10 ounce, we have our 14 ounce, and then our travel mug. All three of our products work the same in terms of exact temperature control. You will notice though that the travel mug actually has the temperature control on the outside of the product via touch sensors, um, where the, the 14 ounce and the 10 ounce mug are more of a set it and forget it model. 
Um, out of the box, they'll come set at exactly 130 degrees. Um, so if you're not super tech savvy or, if, you know, you don't like to have an app for everything, uh, you don't necessarily really have to ever use the app. You can just pour your hot coffee in or your hot tea right away. And then as soon as the, the mug detects that there's a uh, hot liquid in there, it will begin regulating it exactly at 130 degrees due to the components and the, uh, the setup inside. So we'll talk a little bit more about how the product actually works um, on this next slide too. So again, this is our, our 10 ounce mug. Um, and again, really it's a home or an office type of, of vibe. Again, you can, the idea behind it too is that when you put your coffee in it, um, it doesn't need to be on the coaster. And I think that that's something that people don't quite understand when they initially look at our products is that all the technology is actually in the mug itself. So the coaster itself just operates as a wireless charging coaster, just like an iPhone or any other wireless charging device. But all the technology is actually in the mug itself, the lithium ion battery, the thermal sensors, the Bluetooth, um, and everything that's doing to regulate that temperature too is also in there. So you can see here, the main two colors you guys are gonna be having access to are black 10 ounce and our white 10 ounce. We do have a number of different options that we can get into later on more curated or specific um, opportunities that may come to you guys. If someone says, hey, I really want something with metallic or you know, I'm interested in a really like a big wow factor to get something that nobody else has access to, you guys can certainly reach out to us and, and we can get that organized. But what you'll have in-house will be the black and the white. So this little smart LED logo down, or excuse me, this little smart LED strip down here, so this is actually gonna tell you uh, a couple of different things. Um, the first of which is it's gonna tell you that the product's on. Um, so it does go auto to sleep when it detects that there's nothing in it. Um, but this LED strip will actually pulse when the product is getting ready or cooling it or heating it up a little bit until it reaches that exact sweet spot that you have the, the product set up. And then it will maintain that LED when it's actively maintaining the exact temperature. Um, so there's a couple of the product knowledge there. In um, total, the range of temperatures that you can set on our products is between 120 degrees and 145 degrees. Again, out of the box, all the products will come in exactly 130. So really there's no setup required. It, it's actually pretty ingenious how we, we design this. And the idea behind it too was is it was designed for ease of use and that you could just get up and have it running right away. Didn't require a bunch of setup. Don't have to get on your phone to make it work. Um, literally all you'll do is take it off its coaster after you're, you've charged it back up uh, and then put your coffee in and it'll start working right away. So a little bit more again about the, the uh, 10 ounce mug. Um, so on average, depending what your set temperature is, off the coaster, again, when that lithium ion battery is working, I get anywhere between an hour and a half up to two hours. I set my temperature at 128 typically, so I get a little bit more battery life. But it's just like anything, you know, with your phone, if you have your brightness turned all the way up, the battery is not going to last long, as long with our, uh, with our products. If you have the temperature turned all the way up, it's not going to last as long either. Um, and then decoration options on this for you guys is going to be uh, uh, spot printing, um, single, multicolor, or laser engraving on these. And, um, and you guys are pushing out some samples right now that your team will have um, visual access to. And I can show a little bit more in the end about kind of how the product looks when it's, when it's done as well. I think most of so us... So again, in black and white. Great. That's fantastic. So yeah, yeah black right. and white here. Yeah. And then... Um, we do have our metallic collection, which has um, been a really good seller, again, for more specific needs. So I think really the metallic collection has been great for like banking. Um, the financial uh, teams really seem to like the silver. Um, and then obviously we have our gold mugs, which do really well in awards situations, um, anniversary situations too. Um, but the black and white, obviously the best sellers. Same piece here with our 14 ounce, excuse me. Um, and then we have here our uh, rose gold, which is available in the 14 ounce as well. And then we have our copper, no stainless in the 14 ounce, but we do have the black and white, which is fantastic. So now getting into the fun stuff here, here's our travel mug. So this is really um, 
kind of the Lamborghini or the Ferrari of travel mugs, if you say, you know, there's a lot of different um, components that go into this. I've actually got one right here uh, that you can take a look at. So the idea behind this is same to our other temperature control products, but again, you can actually be able to set and maintain the temperature on the actual product itself. And this one, I traditionally get anywhere from three up to four hours of battery life. And again, it's all about maintaining that exact set temperature, right? I'm sure some of you, when you maybe utilize a, like a double walled, um, you know, drinkware product, when you pour it in, it's really, really hot and it stays very, very hot for very long. Um, with our products, the idea behind it is to let that cool down. And then as soon as it detects that it reaches that desired temperature, it's just going to maintain that indefinitely. On the coaster, again, when you're using it on the coaster, it will have that exact set temperature pretty much forever. Um, but then off the coaster is when that lithium ion battery is going to kick in. And that's really what differentiates our products from a lot of other uh, brands. Travel mug. On this guy, we're only going to be able to do single color and multicolor pad prints. Um, and again, that's just because of the, the soft touch poly plastic on this product. And then the packaging for all of our products are, are beautifully designed here. You can actually see this is our red version of the mug, uh, of our travel mug, which is a recent collaboration with Product Red. Um, but all of our products will come in standard retail packaging. Um, so in terms of, you know, the user experience and and being able to, you know, touch and feel an actual retail product. Um, it's, a, it's a pretty neat experience to be able to unbox this with a logo on it, just like you would, you know, if you purchased it from Best Buy or uh, Williams-Sonoma or even ordered one on Ember.com.